Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. How are you guys? I hope you are doing fine. And this is just a quick review of this mask, the Iris and Orchid Rose Mask. So what I like about it, what I don't like about it, how was my skin reaction and all that. So keep on watching. So as always, this is cruelty free and this is the rose mask. So the rose mask is supposed to calm and soothe the skin, which promotes clear skin and minimizes redness, which is what I needed because I have been breaking out. I usually break out but the small pimples and that time of the month is when I get the worst acne. So I had to try this and some of the beneficial ingredients are rose, sage, green tea and avocado extract so it has all that goodness it basically comes in this box and each box brings four masks so this could last about a month or two months depends on how much you use it it's recommended you use it once a week or every two weeks so that's why it will last one month or two months depending on you and it comes like this so this is the plastic baggy and basically the face mask the material is called tensile basically tensile what it is a sustainable fabric regenerated from wood cellulose tensile has natural breathability and absorbs better than cotton it is thinner than other sheet masks and adheres to your skin better unlike most cellulosic fabrics tensile is produced using recyclable, renewable, and biodegradable solvents, making it the number one eco-friendly mask sheet fiber. Tencel is the only suitable choice for sheet masks using organic and natural ingredients. So before you apply it, all you have to do is clean your skin and apply toner to refine skin texture. So the pros to this rose face mask, it's so easy to use. Basically, you take it out and you smooth it all over your skin and you leave it on for about 15 to 20 minutes and just relax. I usually just listen to affirmations or binaural beats for any sounds with the law of attraction. And when you take it off, the cool thing about it, you don't have to rinse your skin all that residue, the liquid that is left from the mask, you can actually reuse that and do a massage on your skin. So you don't have to rinse your skin. And you can use the remaining serum on your face and neck. So I think that's really awesome. As far as my skin, it was a little surprising to my skin. I felt like, like it was cold. <laughs> so when you apply it, maybe you might want to warm it with your hands between your hands. But if you just apply it onto your face just straight, then it will feel cold. Um, but other than that, after a few seconds on being on your skin, that it will warm up. I didn't feel any discomfort at all. I was just relaxing and then when I took off the mask, what it felt was a clean sensation like your skin is smooth, it's hydrated. The con to this mask, which is not a big deal, it was just something that I was not expecting, is that when you take out the sheet mask, it comes so wet. It has a lot of liquid, so just be careful. I recommend you do it over the sink so you don't get the floor dirty or your clothes, but it comes really wet. It has a lot of liquid, which I found it a little surprising. I was expecting more like a baby wipe. A baby be wipe it's wet but not too wet that you don't get everything wet around you so that's like a little downside but no big deal i have the rose face mask which is for calming and soothing but they also have the lemon mask for brightening the aloe vera for deep moisturizing and the rosemary mask for toning and firming everything that i'm mentioning or that i forgot to mention it's going to be in the blog post so that's going to be in the description box and i also added some photos and one cool thing about the glycerin on this product is that it's actually derived from coconut oil so that's something that i found awesome so that's it on my quick review i will keep using the mask because i did like it and i recommend it to you guys again if you want to learn more about this product or if i forgot to mention anything i'm going to add the link in the description box thank you so much for watching and i'll see you guys in the next video kisses bye